This is Coyote News. Vermilion in the summertime, also known as summer verm, looks a little different than the school year. Students often need new housing and many look for work. Coyote News' Sam Coles explores the summer job market. While some students are in a scramble to find what they plan to do in the summer, Vermilion Parks and Recreation tries to offer a solution. Although it may look like a ghost town right now, Prentice Plunge will soon be packed to the brim with swimmers. And with that comes open positions for workers. Vermilion Parks and Recreation offers positions here and other places throughout Vermilion in the summer for students looking for jobs. Jim Goblersch is the director of the Vermilion Parks and Recreation Department, and he says they employ between 100 and 125 people during the summer months in their various positions. Well, we have uh, numerous different types of jobs, from concessionaires to lifeguards to maintenance workers, both on the ball fields, the golf course, and for around the parks here in the city. Early childhood instructors are another option for those who work well with kids, Gobler says. The only requirement for all of the jobs are to be 18 years of age. We offer, you know, a nice opportunity for positions that uh, integrate yourselves even further in the community. So you know more people, um, and sometimes it just reaches out to help the contacts later in life for you when you're looking for jobs. Internship opportunities are also provided for those looking to earn some credits along with their experience. For more information, you can talk to the front desk at the golf course or a secretary at City Hall in the Parks and Recreation Department. For Kyle News, I'm Sam Coles. Thanks, Sam. For a list of city jobs, check out the City of Vermilion's website.